Hello, greetings. Uh, now I'm allowed to go on Facebook, so you can follow me there. I'm uh, my uh, my profile is uh, public, so whatever I post is public, mostly, a lot, all the time actually. So sorry, I haven't been able. I'm not well. I just. Uh, it's the sinking feeling is still there. I feel like dying. Uh, so, uh, with medicine, also some herbal black seeds, you know. Oh, had a headache. It got uh, intense worse. And uh, the, these walls uh, here are quite thin. And my neighbors. So I was moaning and groaning. I uh, still there and slightly. I have not stabilized completely. And uh, I was on Facebook even when I had this headache. But you know what? I cannot uh, thank Gulzar Elia enough for his uh, forgiveness, his uh, apologies to me uh, on his uh, last uh, live stream. It means so much to me that I cannot say. So uh, I, I will start. I cannot afford to cry. Sometimes my tears are so dry. So I will make a, needs a different video for this. Uh, I cannot uh, uh, Thank him enough uh, for understanding, taking the time to go through my videos and all this. Oh, uh, so it was really great of Gulzar Elia. Sorry, my voice is faint. I can't struggle. A little energy has been drained through the pain I felt in my head, and it goes. Like, I'm drinking poison. I can't explain the sinking feeling. I don't know what this is. Uh, as, uh, does this happen when... Uh, is this a uh, cancer symptoms or something? I don't want to go to the doctor. But anyways, I did some research on black seeds. So even the cold or allergy, I think it's good. And for... You know, I had a very terrible... Wisdom toothache. The only thing I was reading a lot for herbal home remedies for toothache. <coughs> we know about the clove, clove uh, remedy, but uh, you know, since I started to take black seeds, it even uh, relaxed. It takes away my toothache pain. Okay, so I came here to say that now I'm on Facebook, I want to, also I'll make a separate video uh, on uh, Gulzar Elia's greatness uh, and apologizing and all this. And I wish uh, them success, him success, his channel, all the bad feelings, all that, I wish I didn't have to carry on that way. <laughs> like from my side also, I commented nasty, went on, uh, unstoppable. So I apologize for that, and I've been forgive, uh, forgiven. Like, uh, so I, I have no words. Like when I get this way, I know I, uh, I have no words. I can just feel. I want to feel this. But recently I've been hit by negative feelings of some other way, some other k a kind. <coughs> okay, uh, miscellaneous things also, and this is about like Dr. Ramana, Dr. Ramana, a covert narcissist about uh, social, uh, anti-social, what do you call them, sociopaths. And so she had a video l lately, I saw it on how to deal with these uh, covert narcissists and 
how to get your power back. So I understood that part where, you know, as she says, don't say you made me, but say that, yes, I am angry, but these word differences, rephrasing of the words, makes a lot of a difference. So you don't give away your power to another. They made me uh, like this, or, you know, they made me angry, for example. That I understand, but I'm still confused about my what I'm I'm doing wrong here, what I have been doing wrong. Like uh, I did want to take responsibility. Uh, that's why I never went to my mother or you know wanted my teacher to go and complain to my mother directly. We could speak about it and not to involve a third person. <coughs> So I, uh, what I maybe I'm just pondering over, like you know when there's a rape, like this is like a psychic attack, rape, but I I didn't want this, like my aunt Mutar. And the jinn said they are from Kashmir mountains. Any Kashmir mountains that you know about her? Or are they just created in the mind for attention? Anyways, in my life, I've seen my grand aunt, very humble, service lady, family, in the family and community. Uh, she, we never used to talk about what we are contributing. Now on uh, YouTube, unfortunately, it has to be shown how much we are paying or contributing. Before that, long time before when I was a child, I've grown up with my grand aunts around me too, like going to the places, <clears throat> and they're taking care of me. So we were never jealous or comparing ourselves to others. And uh, another, uh, so for one, I mean, a cousin of mine who whose aunt is uh, my uh, my grand aunts were his grand aunts too? No, his aunts, sorry. So he said, you know, I, I like, uh, he reminded me in this madness when I spoke to him, called him from Karachi to Oman, that we don't uh, compete in how we were before. And he also told me like, uh, no, no, no one can take your power away. So long time ago uh, in Dubai, Later on, we met, so I was like, uh, no, no, I feel, I feel like someone has been attacking me. And how can I take responsibility? Every step of the way in college, I've taken responsibility. I've used my mind and reasoning with the principal, with a sister, carry the bag or not, go this today or not. But... Lakho samjaya jase Amita Bachan saab ka dialogue hai na kabhi kabhi. And then I told myself every step of the way, <coughs> regardless of what my cousin used to tell me also, like I told him, I've told myself these things. Maybe I did tell him. Maybe I didn't, I don't know. But like I know. Uh, so, I know about these things. And then I took the help of God and the sign. Bibi Mariam gave me a sign the next day. Like, if this is safe to go on. or Okay, on one hand, I told Miss Chafika Fikri when she told me this was dangerous. I wrote to her saying, I know, I know the ins and outs of psychology and all this, right? <coughs> I had been in psychotherapy for six years. So I learned uh, something, and I used to tell them this is beyond, like the love I have for Miss Tissa, adoration, is beyond. You can't, you won't be able to control me uh, through psychotherapy, and they couldn't. Even though at times when I cooperated or I was going there, so oh, it's a very complicated case of mine. Like you see, we say that, uh, yes, there are people who will um, 
get uh, you will feel angry and all this but again i've read many books like that help i read a book which oh sorry like you know self help books and all that western um so yes uh, it is your choice w- what is your response like at that time in college no one's going to hurt me because no one can hurt me i won't allow anyone to hurt me this had become my thing right uh, so even if it is my own mother i take responsibility that i will not get hurt and also uh, you know well or in pity self pity it is your choice to be happy today the world outside for, like no you can't forget it but you also like normal people they sleep over it and come out of it so even if they have a case on them uh, due to a malicious uh, you know relative or something you it is uh, you go on with your life and happily you make a choice that you will be happy and no one has the power to hurt you although they may harm you physically also or attack you or rape you or murder you so so somewhere i got insecure i became very uh, you know i felt the jealous jealousy i absorbed it i became jealous um all this in this madness lower energies before he used to say you know it's not worth it rise above these petty things these are very petty things and even if a big thing like someone like you invite a friend let's say and he he takes away all your belongings and lutefies you so what uh, jesus christ has said give him the cloak if he asks for your coat give him your cloak too or some or the other way around <coughs> and um, so all these things i've been pondering on and i don't know why i feel pulled down and negativity consumed just got out. okay now the idea and god is gone no no it's like see it's there on my neck back of my neck there's some side energy sick kind of uh, making me like lethargic malaise you know feeling of malaise sick uh weak so the shaking took place i was shaking uh due to weakness i had to go to the bathroom or this sh- uh, shake it off with this possession or something okay i don't get it so i don't know what it is I'm confused. Like I went I was in a giddy mood. I went on Parmahamsa Bhakti Marga and said God knows what there you know. Uh-huh. So he was talking about taking responsibility. And then of course you put the rest to on to God, right? You put your best efforts like Imam Ali has also said in Najil Balagha. and then if you feel like uh, you don't go after the god is great i don't think that anyone's the best efforts with god's help like there was robert chuller mr robert chuller's book i read if jesus christ is in your life and if there's love in your heart be sure of one thing whatever the problem may be like nothing can go wrong it will definitely have a solution 
<coughs> so what's this uh, like I have read this book long time ago many many years ago when I was perhaps uh, 19 18 19 20 so Robert A. Schuller's books Robert uh, his junior Robert senior Schuller uh, so all this the great the world's greatest comebacks says Radha Rani also I was resisting I don't want any name or fame and I just don't want Zulm and I'm thinking of you know if there are gurus and these fake gurus and how shall we you know, there has, uh, has to be a way so I'm calling on Narayan Devis because and I wanted to pass away silently in college if I felt I had uh, gotten AIDS due to like it was this feeling of very bad malaise on Fridays and all. Very, uh, no, chronic fatigue, but on Fridays it was like, we would do, was it the syringe? Was it this? Uh, so I got checkups done, I don't know. Do I have cancer in my mind when thinking, 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 although I'd read these books to just rest. So some, you know, the yoga books and all now they're saying, we, I've heard it from the gurus that uh, written is different, but uh, please be careful. It could be dangerous how you do certain yoga asanas. And don't do it from the book. Have a proper yoga guru with you, instructor. So these things harm people. Occult practices harm people. It's not like that I have not taken responsibility. I used to blame myself and, you know, think, I wouldn't say it out loud, but, you know, you, the enemy is not there and you're, jadu kar rahe, iski nazar hai. First, contemplate in yourself, right? Sorry. It, there is a possibility you can as an evil eye be very aware. I don't know how to f solve this problem, like where we can strike a balance or someone is true, someone is uh, too much blaming on others, and then we're not looking at our mistakes. <clears throat> so where everything has its proper place, like put that thing, so that uh, there can be peace, order, and a better world, better human beings can come up. I'm sorry, I don't mean to attack anyone, but I've seen some people doing this. So I didn't want to do this. Blaming others for whatever in my life and uh, also like uh, not taking responsibility. Like where blame is due, you know, judge others. If judge, if this, if judgment needs to be done, brought about. But justice with justice, right? Right is right. Sometimes we, right is right, wrong is wrong, but sometimes we facilitate laws, we can bend them. Uh, so all this I've been pondering over. So I feel that I've been misunderstood. And uh, wait, I'm just, it takes time to have get the words and be able to express myself. I'm not very good at that. Yeah, so you'll, you'll be getting that thing and all, you know, this and all and that and all. Unfortunately, yeah, traumatized like my intellectual capacities, disabled to a certain extent. So, I wish I had an expert. Yeah, so please, thank you so much. Uh, 
please be kind and good and i can believe i don't know i i don't have words i don't think i have words to thank and tell you that everything is great between gulzar elia my brother and me on uh, from youtube so that's really great i really needed to hear this means a great change can come like this you know and uh, so thank you so much i have no words great changes you know but that doesn't mean i still need my principle so uh, still that okay <laughs> thank you very much uh, what else did i want to say i think um, like that uh, So yes, uh, be, uh, no, I don't want to be a Bhagwan or what, oh, yeah, so I said some things on Guru, no, Master, like I also uh, doubt Hinduism now, and uh, so this could be a punishment. Anyhow, on Facebook, I did say live stream that, you know, on the other hand, Rasulullah should have understood that the carvings of idols and all this, to break them, Ibrahim was mad, Hazrat Ibrahim. And I had a relapse today. Uh, no, sorry, yesterday. Yesterday I had a relapse. Again in a major shock. I can't believe this and I can't believe what I... Uh, that Islam is not true. Uh, uh, yeah, I and then when I went, uh, I remembered I had to check on taqiyya, Sunni types, three, four types of taqiyya, I was told, on a YouTube channel of Apostate Prophet, a live stream. So I went there, and then when I looked at Imam Jafri Sadiq saying, um, I was like, oh my. Now this taqiyya also is faith, you know, everything. Yeah, yeah, you have to believe, you have to do, practice this. If you don't practice this, you're out of faith. And so I, then I remembered all the times when, I can't remember the exact narrations of imams, but where I've really, like, uh, doubts I did against imams, doubts had come against him. In Al-Kafi, when I was reading, like, woe be to you. So they explained to me that some people were questioning Imam Ali, Abu Hassan, his title, name, that, uh, you know, in a clever, cunning manner, that's why he used to say, woe be to you, and all that. And sometimes, you know, the his disciples would say, my my mother and this and that ransom now looking uh, i don't know what it was but i had some doubts about uh, so shaitan we think shaitan came shaitan but now in retrospect please don't control me with your uh, unjust ways imams A lot of dis. Oh, what if like someone thinks he's Imam Mahdi, and uh, uh, Hassan Askari is a twelver? We are dead. We are finished. We are ruined. <coughs> so I don't know what I. No, I know what to say, but I can't say it properly. This is the. I feel. Frustrated. So sorry. Ah, so on live stream Facebook, Iblis come in some category of angel thought. Where did it come from now? And uh, relapse. So I haven't I've been. The get it's so quickly a person can change. Going back to Islam. Like, I can't believe, again, 
so much has happened. I've said, still, like I had, a, it's a relapse. I realized I'm still in a shock. Someone can lie like that? And uh, put the children, Fatima Zahra, the do- only daughter. Ooh, I'll throw up. Okay, I'm extremely shocked. Now this is, I'm on this side. Someone, I'm stuck here. What is this? So yeah, it is like a pendulum. Ex-Muslim, and then no, no, no. How can Prophet Muhammad lie like this? I've seen so much. Oh no, that about Imam Hussain is from the Sunni side. From ours, but you said that, uh, why should we listen to Alan Bith? We have to listen to the other side. Because you see, about Zainab bin Josh. So sorry, I've spoken in length in my headache. If you are interested, uh, you can go to my channel. Oh, sorry, not my channel. My profile, Zahra Laila Jawad. And listen to that. Uh, so I can't repeat it again somehow. Okay, I will continue later. I'll try to make another video. Thank you so much.